Howdy, everyone. Uh, welcome to the next Positive Gravity. I'm Doug Howe. Um, today I have this partially done piece. Started on this a while ago. It's walnut. It's a nice piece of walnut. Um, I had it on the lathe, and it, you can see it's got this kind of um, edge here that's the live edge of the, of the tree with the bark removed. And I was hoping to preserve that in this piece. But the result of that, because of the curvature and stuff, is that the rest of the bowl has to be super chunky thick. And I don't like it that way. It's really pretty heavy and just bulky and it's not going to work. So in addition to that, while it was sitting here on the lathe, it got really hot outside. And this developed several cracks. Um, so there's one there. There's a couple in here. And then there's a couple on the outside here. And this pink stuff is where I had done some inlay uh, resin work to fill some cracks. But I don't like that color. So, you know, we're in uncharted territory here. I'm gonna try to save this piece because I like the piece of wood, but I'm gonna do some radical things here. So my plan is to use my Dremel to take out all of this resin work and clean out these cracks. Um, maybe do a little decorative work. I don't know, we'll see. I'm not much of an artist, but could give it a try. And bring this back to a state where I can then put it in resin and somehow do like a thin resin cast onto it to fill all of these imperfections. Um, including this piece. I'll fill that so that it becomes round. And then I can turn mostly from the inside, I think, um, make it into a nice thin bowl. Probably these will become windows or this whole section will be resin. I'm not sure what kind of resin I'll, what color I'll use or anything like that yet. Probably something dark to complement the wood, but we'll see. Um, so anyway, that's my idea. Hoping that I end up with a nice solid piece after that and all this cracking and stuff is secured and that it looks good. So I'm gonna go ahead and get started on that. I'll, I haven't done this kind of like Dremel work before, so I'll bring you in on that and show you how I do it and we'll find out together if it works or not. So let's get to that and see what happens. Thanks for tuning in. Um, yeah, I'm learning as I go on this one, so let's do it.